First of all, I'm not messing around with a bit. I love cottage pie. OK. What I'm preparing now is not a cottage pie. Oh, you're going to... I'm preparing a cottage genomated better pie. Oh, you're It's a different title. <laughs> you're so you're now saying that you are making the traditional British dish of cottage pie better than the British? In my opinion, yes. That's what I'm doing. I think with a few little flavour and a little bit of uh, Gino starch, we can do it better. But I love cottage pie, so everybody from the cottage town, if there is a town called Cottage, <laughs> whatever it is, I don't want to get in trouble with anyone. I love you and I love your pie. But this, right. OK. So what are you doing? You're what talking doing the different. talk. Now First of all, onion, carrots, celery, mushroom. You fry them gently. OK, so, so far, so good. Then we're going to add the meat's beef. So far, so good. Well, no, it's yeah. not, because cottage pie is meant to be done with lamb. For no, lamb is shepherd's oh, no. pie. Oh. See? The shepherds... See, since you wanted to be smart, and oh. you got it wrong. Oh, so, so annoying! <laughs> the beef goes in there, like you would with a normal uh, cottage pie. I don't have mushrooms in my cottage pie. I know. I Do see you? some uh, uh, a cottage pie well, with I, mushrooms. I, think... I don't mind that. Yeah. Oh. I'm not... Uh, again, I, you do what you like. What you wonder if you like mushrooms? I'll tell you, you what, some mushrooms. I'll tell yeah, you what I like about the cottage pie is the fact that you really appreciate the flavour of the meats. Uh, it's not very tomatoey. I make my cottage pie with basil because I think the basil goes very well. And I change the uh, topping. Instead of using normal potato, I use sweet potatoes. Yeah. This and is, I pull this part is where the wheels come off. And they, uh, why? Well, so you're, you're mucking about with a crispy topping of a proper cottage pie. Oh, no, I can still do a crispy topping. You don't worry about it. Let me... Uh, Let's uh... see. OK, now, you do the meat like you would do with a normal uh, cottage pie. Then you put wine, OK? Do you guys put wine in yours? Yeah. yeah. Very good. So, so far, it's very, very uh, similar. Oh, look, okay, I have to come here and I have to defend myself when I cook. Only because it's you tread on very dangerous territory. Now, once the wine, uh, once the wine evaporates, which is very important, we're then going to add the basil, mm -hmm. which I think it gives a nice kick to the cottage forward slash to the, to the better bol pie. To the bolognese you are making, making a, a bolognese, bolognese sauce and putting some potato on top. I'm not making a bolognese. But that is what you're doing. <laughs> Yes, I am doing that. <laughs> All right, I am doing that. I, I can't hide. I'm making some kind of a, some kind of a bolognese sauce, and I put the potato on top. Well, is that what cottage pie is all about? No. Well, what is it then? It's well, just it's meat. Just not that. Look, you, you put exactly. the basil. You put the basil in there. Then you put the tomato. To like be fair, this. I like the idea of yours. I think it will taste lovely, but it's not a cottage pie. I never pretended to that I want to do a cottage pie. I'm doing a cottage forward slash Gino made it better pie. It's a different <laughs> title. OK? So once you put everything together, salt and pepper, you reduce it 45 minutes, and that's what you get. So, 45 look minutes at that. To 45 oh, minutes no, to today. reduce it, you get that. There is no need to try yet. We haven't finished. I just now, wanted to see the stage. Ah, OK, so look at the stage. I've got sweet potatoes here. I mash them and I put them in clean film. The reason why I put... Ask me why. Why? why? The, good question. The reason why I put them in clean film because the vapour inside makes the potato wetter. Okay. So it's easy, uh, uh, easy to handle. I put a little bit of milk in there, full fat, none of the semi-skin uh, uh, semi malarkey thing. Then butter, a little bit of uh, parmesan goes in there. Do you put Parmesan cheese in yours? Uh, or you put sometimes. cheddar? Got a minute and a half. Um, Easy. Okay. Yeah, but yeah, yeah, occasionally, you know, if we go off-piste. Yeah, you put it there. Then, very simple, OK? You... I can't see any basil in here. Yeah, there is the basil in there, he, because he, 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 he welts, the basil. He welts. <laughs> welts is the one? Wilts. Wilts. Oh. He wilts. Wilts, <laughs> welts, <laughs> potato, potato. <laughs> now, at this point, what we do, we put it here, then we push it down like that, and this is how you get the crispy, OK? Do it mm -hmm. with a fork, mm -hmm. OK? Just poke it out like that with a the fork. Then Parmesan cheese on top. Mm -hmm. In the oven, 200 degrees. This goes for about 25 minutes to half an hour. Mm. There is an argument that sweet uh, potato is better for you. Yeah. Yes. Not only is be I think the sweet potato works better because the sweetness goes very well with my uh, meat sauce. And there you have it. Meat sauce? With the meat with sauce. With what's underneath? Yes, with what's Can underneath. Can we just put this alongside now, a British yes. one, please? First because... of all, let's be honest, which, which one looks better? <laughs> that, <one. laughs> that does look better. Why? 
I don't know. It's something about because, the colours. No, because your brain tells you that that's what you used to. Mm. But if you... I've uh, got to say, Gino, that is really, really tasty. I have to say, yeah. that does taste good. No, but that this one, a good cottage pie is, is also a good dish. Just to give the idea to people to do something slightly different, to use... You know, you could have used pumpkin. Mm. You know, Halloween, just you could have used a pumpkin topping. Yeah. I'm going to be honest. Go on, I Please. think yours is really delicious, but... The traditional cottage pie is more beefy and you can really taste the mint. Yes. This, I think that the sweet potato slightly, it's not like you, it doesn't taste very beefy. It's a delicious flavour, but it's not as beefy as that. And you're right. And the reason why this is, the cottage pie is more beefy is because they use less tomato. They put one tablespoon uh, of tomato puree in yeah. there. Some people put no tomato whatsoever, so it's very But that is beefy. delicious. That is a really Two nice... very different one. Faye got in touch with us and okay. has said that she puts baked beans in hers. OK, that's taking the mic. <laughs> is it? We are... No, no, that, that's taking... Faye, really? <laughs> baked beans? How can you put baked beans in a, a cotton Some good fibre. Good fibre. You can put in You could put you spaghetti like. hoops. <laughs> 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 Tell me we're going to be off air very soon and the news <laughs> is going to come on. Thanks for watching. Click here for more this morning videos.